Hey there my fellow mobile gamers, welcome back to Gaming at Max. In today's video, we're gonna take a look at the top 10 new mobile games for the month of April 2024. This roundup contains some appealing games, especially for those who are tired of playing their current game or are simply looking for something new to play on their mobile devices. If you enjoy mobile games, go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel, and join us in our journey of discovering new game titles weekly. Let's get started! Starting off at number 10, we have Drive Division. Drive Division is an adrenaline-fueled automotive game where players engage in high-speed races, accelerating drifts, and extensive car customization. With daily challenges and rewards, players can enhance their skills and progress while taking control of 32 iconic cars, each customizable to reflect their own style. Various game modes such as Checkpoint Time Attack, Drift Rush, Paid Drift Practice, and Free Roam offer diverse challenges and opportunities to master driving techniques and earn various rewards, providing an immersive experience in the ultimate showdown of speed and style. Graphics are also decent, so if you're looking for a simple yet fun racing game, this is for you. Moving on to number 9, we have Guns and Gangs. Guns and Gangs is a multiplayer shooter FPS game where players team up to dominate the greedy urban war zone street. In this action-packed deathmatch, strategic loadouts are key as players aim to climb the top of the power ranks. With customizable weapons and unlockable characters, players can tailor their arsenal to their unique combat style. Designed for mobile, Guns and Gangs offer a decent action and graphics for thrilling gameplay on the go. Also, this is a very familiar game as it seems to be inspired by Valorant and CSGO. If you're into shooter games and are looking for something new, there you have it. Next up at number 8, we have Fire Sky. Fire Sky is a dynamic fantasy RPG where players embark on a thrilling journey, battling enemies, and uncovering deep and dark narrative set in a world engulfed in an ancient war. With captivating characters and lush environments, players collect heroes and cards to craft powerful weapons, all while striving to become the ultimate guardian in a universe. Whether delving into the extensive story mode or engaging in intense PvP battles, Fire Sky offers strategic depth and immersive gameplay, inviting players to master their skills and unravel the mysteries of the multiverse to defeat the formidable king and his army. In the game, you basically just dodge enemy attacks and then counterattack when you see an opportunity. This game is quite decent, especially if you're into some ancient theme action game. And it's got some nice looking graphics too. At number 7, we have Made in Academy Idol RPG. Made in Academy offers an engaging idol strategy experience where players arrange their battle companions strategically to fend off invaders. With over 60 heroes to collect and cultivate, players can enjoy the thrill of assembling a powerful team. By drawing heroes, increasing combat power, and developing battle strategies, players can overcome increasingly powerful enemies. The game features various gameplay modes and allows for offline earnings, ensuring a dynamic and rewarding gaming experience for fans of casual, collecting, and gacha games alike. If you're a gacha gamer or a fan of idle games, this might be for you. Sitting at number 6, we have Fairy Tale Fierce Fight. For those anime enthusiasts out there, the first Fairy Tale English version is finally here, and it's available on both Android and iOS devices. Fairy Tale Fierce Fight is a brand new official 3D action mobile game that combines elements of ARPG and magic, inviting players to experience an intense, passionate anime storyline of Fairy Tale. You engage in intense 3D battles, strategically utilizing diverse wizard types and unique canon relationships to defeat 40 wizards in a deep detailed environment. With original voice actors and immersive gameplay, including PvP battles, challenging bosses, and various quests, players embark on a thrilling adventure to build the ultimate team and sharpen their combat skills. If you're an anime game lover, this would be quite a nice addition to your anime ARPG collection. Moving on to number 5, we have Astra Knights of Veda. Now, this is a captivating tactical side scrolling action game fantasy adventure set in a continent oppressed by the ruthless Mad King Magnus, where you embody the new master of the book, guided by Veda's wings to challenge the darkness. Through stunning artwork and immersive storytelling, players embark on a journey through a meticulously crafted world filled with mystery and allure. With each knight offering unique abilities and weapons, players assemble a team tailored to their playstyle to conquer challenging dungeons. With its deep narrative and expansive cutscenes, Astra Knights of Veda promises a richly woven experience that seamlessly blends thrilling action with hauntingly beautiful fantasy world. If you're into games that offer a very good storyline, music, and gameplay, you should definitely try this one. 
Next up at number 4, we have Junkineering. Junkineering is a turn-based RPG where players venture into a post-apocalyptic world where they craft a squad of robots using everyday junk animated by an AI core brain. Encounter a variety of enemies in iconic locations, traverse vibrant wastelands, and partake in PvP battles for an ironic field adventure. The game's quirky design and animation are actually quite decent. You face weird creatures like poisonous-looking rats whose bones are sticking out. I personally think this game is quite fun. Definitely a good one to kill time. Sitting at number 3, we have Night Crows. Now, I originally didn't want to include this game on this list because of how bad it is and how bad the feedbacks are, but hey, it's a new game after all, which is what this video is all about. So, Night Crows is an MMORPG that puts players in a 13th century European continent brimming with sword and magic, where chaos reigns supreme. Now, the game might look good because of it being made with Unreal Engine 5 and brings realistic graphics, but the gameplay is really awful in my opinion. It's kind of slow that you wouldn't want to continue playing. Also, I'm not against autoplay even though I'm not a fan of it, but in Night Crows, you will simply be overwhelmed by it. Which is also why the game only received negative feedbacks from players. Down to number 2, we have Solo Leveling Arise. This one is one of the most anticipated game of the year. Solo Leveling Arise invites players to embark on a world-changing level-up journey based on a legendary webtoon with over 14 billion global views. In the game, you play as Jinwoo, the weakest hunter who evolves into the strongest and experiences gripping experience while uncovering all new story developed exclusively for the game. You will enjoy high-quality graphics that bring webtoon to life and immerse yourself in thrilling combat where gears and skills influence your fighting style. Encounter fun favorite hunters from the original story and build diverse team to tackle shifting dungeons and powerful bosses to become the monarch of shadows. If you're a manhwa or webtoon reader or have already watched the anime adaptation of solo leveling, you don't want to miss this one. Finally at number 1, we have Call of Duty Warzone Mobile. Call of Duty Warzone Mobile brings the iconic Call of Duty action to your fingertips with innovative FPS Battle Royale gameplay. Now I'm pretty sure most of us already know what this game is about, but for those who don't, this is the most popular Battle Royale game on PC and console right now. Also, as most of us here are aware of, Warzone Mobile received such negative feedback, especially from Android users because of the game seemingly not ready yet for most phones on the platform. But Activision, its developer and publisher is constantly working on patches and optimizations to get the game to run with less issues on Android phones. The game is still new and just released recently after all, so you know, that's to be expected. And there you go my fellow mobile gamers, those were the top 10 new mobile games that you would enjoy in the month of April 2024. I hope you found this video informative and if you did, consider supporting us by liking the video and subscribing to the channel. It's free and you get to make us happy. Thank you very much for hanging out with me today. This has been Gaming at Max and I will see you in the next video. Happy gaming!